News ID 1,542,538 Service Nuclear October 11, 2017 The Prime Minister reaffirmed the UK's strong commitment to the deal alongside our European partners, saying it was vitally important for regional security, a statement from May's office said on Tuesday night, the National reported. The PM stressed that it was important that the deal was carefully monitored and properly enforced, it added. Britain's Foreign Secretary Boris Johnson has also stepped up diplomatic efforts to save the deal. In a statement, he said, the UK supports the deal and stresses the importance of all parties continuing to uphold the commitments. US President Donald Trump's team now faces an October 15 deadline to tell Congress whether it will continue to certify that Iran is complying with the deal. If Trump refuses to certify, Congress will have 60 days to decide whether to reimpose U.S. sanctions on Iran. Last month, Trump, during an address before the United Nations General Assembly, said, the Iran deal was one of the worst and most one-sided transactions the United States has ever entered into. Frankly, that deal is an embarrassment to the United States, and I don't think you've heard the last of it. Iran and the Group 51 Russia, China, the US, Britain, France and Germany reached the 159-page nuclear agreement in July 2015 and implemented it in January 2016, since the historic deal was signed in Vienna. The International Atomic Energy Agency IEA has repeatedly confirmed the Islamic Republic's compliance with its commitments under the JCPOA, but some other parties, especially the US, have failed to live up to their undertakings. All stories about contact us archive sitemap.